Radio Rodin, hello Okay guys, we are back with a new episode of Legends of Tomorrow. I'm very excited to see what's gonna happen here. Because apparently Bishop is back. He was able to kind of print himself in the way writer. So I can wait to see how this is gonna go. And I don't want to talk too much and just get down to it. So let's do it. Let's go. Oh yes, please kill this body. What are you doing here? How are you even alive? Can he kill the body? Why? Shouldn't I just slit your throat and watch you bleed out on my carpet? <laughs> yes, please. Mika, you're looking at the last gen me, but that's cool. Well, can you just kill him? You. And that's you're it. Kidnapped me. You what me else do you need to know? Every possible way. True, true. You see, I've changed. All right. That's Bishop? Not at all what I was expecting. For a psychotic super villain, the guy's got a great look. Yeah, they always do. <laughs> I always got a great Shall we start with the introduction? Oh my gosh. You are, of course, Ava. Not just any Ava. The Ava. Congratulations, by the way. The Ava. Why did you just Ava call her the Ava? So, or, or like Sarah's Ava, I guess. Talk to him. Keep an eye on him. Try to escape, shoot him in the face. You got it, Capitan. <laughs> you got it, Capitan. Yes. Like She's I the only one that can do home. it. You're not home. You're gonna get out of here, and we're not gonna see you again. Please. A true psychopath wouldn't want to just murder the woman who destroyed his life work. He'd really want to take some time torturing her, you know? Thanks, babe. That's very reassuring. <laughs> but if Bishop wants to play chess, he has yeah. chosen the wrong opponent. Uh, no. No, no, no. Absolutely not. Please. Come on, babe. I've always wanted to get inside the mind of an evil genius. Who technically speaking created you? <gasps> yes. Both of you, actually. Not helping me. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I'll just Both go in there and try to find a way to connect with him. Yeah. That way we can figure out why the hell he's here. You sure? Yes. Okay. Okay, I'm right. scared about right. this. Just don't Because this okay? she's wearing the, the shirt then she's scared on the trailer. She's like, <gasps> so, I mean, something's going to happen here, I think. I hope Ava's going to be fine. Please. You know, but I'm very scared about this. I take it the beast got me. No, John, that was me. I stabbed the beast in the back and somehow you woke up with a scar. Look, I can explain. Yes. Oh, can you? How you lied to me yet again. Lion was part of Daddy's game. I didn't make up the rules, love. Don't call me love. And don't pretend like this was all a game. You know what my brother was right about you? You're different, John. Yeah, I'm different. I mean, how many people do you know have drunk from the fountain of bloody Imperium? But don't worry, all right? But you didn't. I just, maybe I should woodshed my magic by myself, eh? Yeah, yeah, I think that's best. Oh my god, oh, you're on, breaking up. up. Damn it, Johnny. Yeah, you're stupid, John. You have to stop drinking that thing. Hey, I'm serious. You would still be stuck in that game if it weren't for me. Please, look. Yes, I like this what happened with John friendship. It is not my help you need. Spoons. That is a great yes, idea. Yes, she, she was knows. there. <laughs> she knows what happened. Drama. I was hoping we'd have a chance to kibitz. Get to know each other, just you and me. But you already know me. You had a planet full of me's, didn't you? Don't sell yourself so short. Sarah could have had her pick of my Avas. If she turned over the heavens to get back to you. So what makes you so special? <laughs> Sarah said you'd do this. Try to get in my head. I knew this was a mistake. No, wait, 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 wait. wait. This was, you Please. were, you wanted Don't this, go. Ava. We've hardly you know this. Ice. She's playing him. She's playing him. Mm, that a girl. It's yeah. <laughs> I know this is going to sound perverse, but you and Sarah are the closest thing I have left to family. Okay, that's weird. I know. Sounds insane. No, I get yeah. it, actually. But yeah. You're a clone, I'm a clone, and it's not like I have any real family. So, sure, I guess in some perverse way, we are like family. Weird. Playing him like a fiddle. Is Can she I manipulating him? Tell you a secret. Because it's real. They are kind of like you family. You were always my favorite Ava. Your model. Your model. You mean bossy Ava. Ugh, a moniker our marketing department came up with. I wanted to call you Boss Ava. Only people were afraid of a clone that would tell them what to do. Except that is precisely what you were designed for. <laughs> well, you 
have exceeded okay. my wildest dreams. You're getting married. Didn't see that one coming. Why not? I lower the oxytocin levels in all the clones. The so-called love hormone. I don't want you falling in love. It hurts productivity. Maybe that's why I'm having such a hard time planning this damn wedding. Productivity is usually my strong suit, and I can't even put together a seating arrangement. Maybe I can help. Uh, not like I have any Oh, honey, no, don't find. open up to him. Uh, if Sarah even knew I was talking to you. Oh, come on. That'll be our little secret. I don't know if she's still playing How him. I know you're not just doing this to get me to let my guard down. Or she's opening up. I don't know. I want to get to know you, Ava. Mm. I have to go. I don't know. Uh, I don't like that. Oh, guess it worked. Of course it did. I made Bishop think that I needed something from him, and he proved himself to be trustworthy for now. But believe me, <laughs> this is just the opening move of our little chess match. The words that make me. I love Ava oh. and how she thinks. <laughs> but she's going to open up. I oh. think she's going to break. What? Just alien taste buds. What can I say? Are you sure it's okay we leave Spinner in there alone with Bishop? <laughs> There's no way he's getting in her. She's head. eating that thing. Sarah, <laughs> you're being weird. <laughs> hey, what happened when John drank from the fountain of Imperium? Uh, I was with them and the kid Fernando in the cave. The fascists were coming and. The, the fascists were coming and. Oh, because he made her forget. Right! Oh my god! Whoa. It's like something's missing, like a blank spot in my memory. Oh. Like something's been erased. Yeah. You think John put a spell on me? I'm gonna kill him. Uh, just not until we find out what he wanted you to forget. Which means I'm gonna have to put another spell on you. Yes, help Spoon, please. But maybe he drank something he shouldn't have? I am a doctor. No. John's fine. <laughs> Yeah, he's not. I mean, if he can help him, good. You'll never be clean, Johnny. <laughs> you know, you're not even real. This was a figment of my imagination, some damn junkie hallucination. And without magic, you're just a pathetic ex-smoker in a trench coat who lies to the people he loves. But at least I'll be rid of you. Yeah, okay, please I'll help him. Then. And then leave Bishop? Like, no, 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 I hope no, he no, does stop. something. Oh. oh my gosh, she's sharing the wedding yes. binder. Heard that. Uh, Sarah put me in charge because usually I'm the decisive one and I can't seem to choose a single thing. What's the coolest wedding you've ever been to? Huh? What kind of vibe are we talking? Um, I've never actually been to a wedding. Hmm? Yeah, I was sort of known as the uh, party pooper at the time bureau, so. Hey, look. Stop being the boss. I know. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, look, you're just putting too much pressure on yourself. Just oh, go with that. I can't. I don't... What if I choose something weird? Who cares? Speed round. What's your favorite flower? Uh, is cactus a flower? Color. Gray. Appetizer? See, this thing about appetizers, I don't understand why people have to eat before they eat. Okay! So <laughs> the ceremony will be unconventional, but it's all you. Yeah, I love that. I'm weird. Why the hell did you have to make me so weird? Look, first off, I didn't make you. Yes, I designed you. And everything you've done in your life, that's your accomplishment, not mine. And you not knowing whether you want a vegan cake Okay, or not I like that, doesn't though. Doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm gonna take that back. Vegan cakes are disgusting. <sighs> Thank you for trying to help. I really appreciate it. Hey, don't forget. I mean, I like what he I'm said. I'm just laughing. I'm weird. I don't know clone, what to think about this. Clone of a clone of a clone. How exactly is this you different from the you Sarah knew? There was something missing from the me that Sarah met on Pliny X19. It took me a long time to find it. You want to know what it was? If you want to tell me. Humility. Ah! What a lying piece of crap. Humility. Wow. Wow, yeah, that's not. Oh god. I don't trust you. Yeah, bite my tongue off. Tortured mind with secrets hidden. Show me that which is forbidden. I found that. I found him didn't want John. I decided he wasn't worthy. But then how did he get his magic back? He took a sip of something. Look, I don't know what it was, but when he drank it, that's when he killed the soldiers who were attacking us. Yeah. Where the hell are you he going? He kills a lot oh, of I'm people. I'm just gonna break up with my lying dumpster fire of a boyfriend. A juiced up warlock who likes to kill people? I don't think so. First, we need to figure out exactly 
what John's been dosing himself with. Yeah, please. You're betrothed. And the help case. him stop. Looks punky. Mm -hmm. well, I guess Sarah and I got engaged at a punk show, so same night that you kidnapped her, actually. You want to know the even crazier thing? If you hadn't kidnapped her, she may never have proposed. It wasn't until we all went back that same night a second time that she uh, popped the big question. A real mind bender, huh? Yeah. What do you think? I like it. So I'm not sure how you how do you dance to it. Let me show you. It'll be our. Are they gonna dance? Father daughter dance. Oh my god. I'm not sure that's a good idea. You mean with Sarah watching? You knew. Aren't you gonna dance with him? Feed. That can't be good. Ava is just making Bishop think that she is playing into his hand, like I am doing to you. Really? I don't know. I'm, this mind things really get to me. I don't know what they are actually doing. I'm sorry I've cried before. I'm scared. So, mm. Sarah's gonna love it. Makes me wanna smile and cry all at the same time. Yes, I know exactly how you feel. Why? Did you design me to feel that way? What difference does it make? All of us are just a jumble of neurons and synapses. Why should your feelings be any less real than anyone else's? I'm proud of you, Ava. I hate this because I think he's getting to her. We have a dance of our own on your special day. I can't. It's really getting to her, right? I mean, I am wondering, is it is it the situation that is getting to her? Is it the song because she was programmed for a reason to feel sad and happy at the same time when she listens to it? Like, was that song literally programmed to do that to her? Or she's just feeling a lot because this is actually the person that created her. Created her, right? So, I don't know. I feel for Ava. Like, I hate this because it's such a complicated situation and... I think it's like they're trying to play him, but it's actually something that she has feelings and she's feeling things towards Bishop and, well, towards the situation because Bishop is who created her, right? So I think it's a, it's like a term, turmoil of emotions. I don't know how the correct word is, but it's like a lot, I think. And I'm also getting confused on who's tricking who, you know? But I'm, I hate that Amy's feeling like this because she doesn't deserve to feel like she was made up or something. So I really hope she's okay. And I, I really wanna see how this is gonna end up. So let's keep watching.